welcome to the Twitter reaction shows Liverpool beat Leicester by three crazy goals to two crazy goals. It was brilliant. I'm going to get straight into it. Hopefully you've watched my match reaction. Hopefully you've enjoyed that. If you haven't subscribed to Red Men, do it. Do it now. Um, TJ McCarty at TJ McCarty. Sometimes I'd like us to win and have the last 30 minutes be boring rather than a heart attack. With that said, God, I love us when we attack, mate. Perfectly surmising everything that is being a Liverpool supporter. It's just, it's mental. You just want them to take the sting out of the game. That's why you bring James Milner on, but you, they can't. They just haven't got it in the locker. We're just a crazy bastard team with crazy bastard players and no frigging defenders that are worth their salt. It's mad, it's mad, it's mad. Enjoy it. Uh, Monstasi 14. We played well against 14 men. Ref and Linos were so poor. Uh, Linos have got a couple of decisions right, but generally speaking, um, the referee was a uh, atrocious, wasn't he? The Jamie Vardy won for the free kick at the end of the first half. The Okazaki pulling down Simon Mignolet. The, I mean, just terrible refereeing across the board over and over and over again. Mental, mental. Thanks for your comment, mate. At unknown XYZ, I need a heart transplant. Yes, and there is many, many Liverpool fans out there now, mate, who are exactly the same as you. At Red's report, wow, Phil is pure class. Great to hear support for him. Matip was a beast. Refs were shite. Shakespeare's a hamster. Hashtag match reaction. Shakespeare's a hamster. There we go. Uh, at Lewis Jones 90, we don't half make things difficult for ourselves. A win is a win, though, and I couldn't have said it better myself. Robert T. Ramsey at Shogun Rock. We're the most lopsided team in the league, but a win's a win, and I'll gladly take that. Manny back next week. Bring it on. Massive three points. Massive game. Massively needed for our confidence going into Moscow on Tuesday night. And then Newcastle next week. Wow, it's going to be another big week for Liverpool Football Club. But we needed that three points. We couldn't have taken a draw there. That would have killed us off as fans, I think. And maybe even the team's confidence. At Joe underscore Kenaz. Very good win. Showed heart and we deserved the win. Need to tighten up defensively still, said every Liverpool fan ever. At Harsh Kapoor. Good, simple football. Hope we play more aerial through balls, especially with Mo Salah's pace. Phil Coutinho back to his best. Can't wait for Mane. I disagree with the simple football. I think it is incredibly intricate at times how Liverpool attack, but we can play more simple football. I know what you mean, if that's what you mean. Like, you know, the aerial balls to Salah, Phil Coutinho, Mane when he comes back, of course. You know, we've got options we can build up slow and we can hit people on the counter attack we can play a long ball it's great to see as an attacking force we're wicked absolutely wicked at Clarves Mises before the pen I was just saying stay in the middle Mignolet stay in the middle Vardy always goes for power mad game much needed three points on to Moscow I was exactly the same it would probably be on the story of the match later called Vardy down the middle well after I'd seen the graphic that says he's hit last four penalties out of five down the middle anyway I wouldn't have said it other than that nice three points but one of the worst games by a referee that I've seen in a long time and I'm not even asked anymore because Liverpool got three points. I was asked during the game, I really was. But now, fuck him. Fuck Anthony Taylor. Fuck his referee. Yeah, fuck him now. Uh, LFC, Rob. Henderson showed up big time today. He was brilliant. Deserves huge credit from a massive for a massive captain's performance. Genie missing again though. Uh, I do want to end it on the Henderson stuff actually. Uh, that's the last comment. Superb performance by him. He's needed that. And he's needed to show Liverpool fans that he can still produce that level of a performance on the pitch. And people might be out there now saying, oh, it's only Leicester and all that. Like, but he dominated that game and we needed him to dominate that game. He was absolutely superb. He won the ball back so many times. Standing up big, standing up firm, passing the ball. Everything about that game, getting the winning goal. Just an absolute captain's performance. And I love ending the show on that. So thanks very much for watching. Don't forget to drop a like on the video if you would, please. And comment with your thoughts and your reaction underneath the video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.